frame since uh, the artwork is not super large and the printer can handle it so uh, i just moved on to fusion 360 as you can see here i'm just uh, making this very simple uh, sketching a rectangle uh, from the uh, cent center uh, the rectangle has to be a little bit smaller than the artwork that's why i'm putting 7.85 uh, i'm putting two rectangles at first um, and then uh, i'm going to add an ex another rectangle later but these first two i'm going to use them uh, to uh, extrude them uh, to the size that i want to extrude them to and then the final rectangle i'll use it as the uh, uh, the rabbit or uh, the recess edge that you know uh, frame needs so you can put the glass and the artwork and set it so it can stays nice and and clean uh, so as you can see here uh, uh, in fusion 360 you can do, you can do this very easy uh, and it doesn't really take a long time and that's uh, what I like about uh, doing this type of projects it doesn't take you forever uh, the whole project took me less than two hours I sketched this in Fusion 360 in about five minutes maybe maybe a little bit longer than that you know uh, counting measuring the artwork and putting the numbers together so it took me probably 10 minutes uh, and you get a simple yet effective way of making a frame that will look nice and satisfy uh you know your significant other or your kid that's that wants that done very quickly so after i'm done designing the uh frame in fusion 360 i'm gonna save it i'm saving it as an stl file and then uh, uh actually uh, i'm exporting it as an stl file and then i'm gonna move on to the 3d printer uh, software uh, in this case I'm using uh, what is it called I'm using the orca slicer uh, so I slice my file there and as you can uh, probably see here as you can see in the video the uh, time that it's gonna take to print this frame is about an hour and 22 minutes uh, so we're just gonna export the file to uh, an SD card you can always send it through Wi-Fi if you have your printer connected to your uh, network the card then just take it to the printer and just run it you can see here uh, the printer is running and it's printing the uh, frame uh, the way I designed it on Fusion 360 so I made two frames for my wife and kid um, one my kid wanted her frame to be black and my my uh, wife wanted her frame to be pink uh, so that's where you see here in the video uh, the, the black frame didn't come out perfect uh, I had to paint it a little bit to make it a little bit better and make it shine and pop a little uh, so I just used like regular acrylic paint and I just went over it very quickly uh, then I just let it dry, put the artwork on. The other, uh, the other frame, the pink frame was great, like nothing. I didn't have to do anything to it. I just cleaned up a little bit of the glue that I put on uh, the Neptune uh, 4 Plus uh, for the filament to stick. Just cleaned that up a little bit and then it was really ready. So uh, yeah, there you go. Uh, very nice, very easy project to make during uh, a couple hours it, you know, in the weekend. These are the type of project that I like to uh what i like to do because you know in during the week you're very busy you know with full-time job and stuff and i actually like to get a project done uh very quickly because i'd like to have that satisfaction of finishing something uh, please let me know if uh, you enjoyed this type of video uh, i can make more of them leave a comment and uh, yeah i'll see you on the next one thank you